Within 24 hours after fertilization, the egg that will become your baby rapidly divides into many cells. By the eighth week of pregnancy, the embryo develops into a fetus. There are about 40 weeks to a typical pregnancy. These weeks are divided into three trimesters. The start of pregnancy is actually the first day of your last menstrual period. This is called the gestational age or menstrual age. It's about two weeks ahead of when conception actually occurs. Though it may seem strange, the date of the first day of your last period will be an important date when determining your due date. Your healthcare provider will ask you about this date and will use it to figure out how far along you are in your pregnancy. Each month, your body goes through a reproductive cycle that can end in one of two ways. You will either have a menstrual period or become pregnant. This cycle is continuously happening during your reproductive years, from puberty in your teen years to menopause around age 50. In a cycle that ends with pregnancy, there are several steps. First, a group of eggs gets ready to leave the ovary for ovulation. The eggs develop in small, fluid-filled cysts called follicles. Think of these follicles as small containers for each immature egg. Out of this group of eggs, one will become mature and continue on through the cycle. This follicle then suppresses all the other follicles in the group. The other follicles stop growing at this point. The mature follicle now opens and releases the egg from the ovary. This is ovulation. Ovulation generally happens about two weeks before your next menstrual period begins. It's generally in the middle of your cycle. After ovulation, the open ruptured follicle develops into a structure called the corpus luteum. This secretes releases the hormones progesterone and estrogen. Progesterone helps prepare the endometrium. This lining is the place where a fertilized egg settles to develop. If you don't become pregnant during a cycle, this lining is what is shed during your period. On average, fertilization happens about two weeks after your last menstrual period. When the sperm penetrates the egg, changes occur in the protein coating of the egg to prevent other sperm from entering. At the moment of fertilization, your baby's genetic makeup is complete, including its sex. The sex of your baby depends on what sperm fertilizes the egg at the moment of conception. Generally, women have a genetic combination of XX and men have XY. Women provide each egg with an X. Each sperm can be either an X or Y. If the fertilized egg and sperm is a combination of an X and Y, it's a boy. If there are two Xs, it's a girl.